planes follow these weird curved paths, but why? Planes take the shortest path between two places. In 2D, that's a straight line. On a 3D Earth, a straight line isn't possible, so the shortest path must be an arc. But how do we find the shortest arc? Let's understand with two points in 2D, we can connect them with arcs of circles. As the circle grows, the arc shortens, approaching the shortest straight line path. So the shortest path can be thought of as the arc of the largest circle through the two points. The same applies to Earth. We can join the two places by an arc along the Earth's surface. This is the corresponding circle, but many such circles exist. Which one is the largest? Notice the circle grows until it reaches a point, then starts shrinking. So at exactly this point, it's the largest. What's special about this point? The center of the circle and the Earth are the same. So connecting two places with a circle that shares the Earth's center always gives the shortest path. So planes roughly follow this path, but obviously at some height above the Earth's surface. That's why